Hello and welcome. My name is Jesus Omar Gallegos. Please call me Mr. Gallegos and I will be your teacher for Money Matters here at Brackenridge High School for the school year. The purpose for this video is to show you how you're going to do your work, where the lessons are found, and a little bit about myself. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to go ahead and share my screen. Now you might be getting this as an email from me to you and you might not know how to even get into our platform that we're using, which is Canvas. So the first thing I'm going to do is show you all how to get to Canvas. The way the, what you do is you go to saisd.net, right? you go to the district's homepage, find the link that says parents and students, click on that. Down here where it says Canvas Resources and Training, click on that. And then they've got some videos for y'all on how to get to Canvas. So I've already clicked on it. It's a good video. Um, it talks about Canvas, how to get to it. The important thing that he says in here is how to actually get there. So I'm fast forwarding to that spot right there. So you go to this link right here, HTTP, the slashes, link.saisd.net. When you click on that, it should look like this. Once you log in, you're going to find I'm waiting on this to show you your dashboard. You're going to see your dashboard. There it is. All right, so I'm going to press pause. Now this is here for you all, for parents and for students, for you all to learn how to use Canvas, all right, because that's what we're going to be using. I'm going to go to Canvas. So what is talking about that dashboard, this is Canvas right in here. You're going to see my class called Money Matters. Click on Money Matters. In here, what I'd like for you to do is read all this information I have from you. It basically tells you who I am, what I'm about, what I've done, where I'm going, all this good stuff, stuff about the course, stuff that I'm not going to talk about in this video, or at least I'm not going to go into detail, but the details are in there because you are going to have a quiz on it. Then I'm going to click here, this bottom that bottom link there, and it's going to open up our modules. We're going to do all of our work inside of these modules. These modules I'm going to set up uh, on a weekly basis. So everything for, say, this first week is in here. And I'm going to go into all of this here in a bit. All right, now, I provided this link so that you don't get lost. The other way to get to these modules, I'm going to get rid of it, is to go over here to the left and click on modules. Okay, so here we are. After you visit the home page, read that information, click on this very first thing, uh, weekly overview and instructions. Here is where you're gonna have what we're gonna do for the week. Um, so again, we have modules, we're gonna be using Zoom, and I'm gonna have your due dates, so I do have two assignments for you all for this week, this first week. Everything is going to be due by Friday the 21st. The first thing is I want you to watch this orientation video that I'm creating. So you're actually watching it right now. And then I want you to do the orientation assignment. There's two different versions of it. There's the synchronous and the asynchronous. Synchronous is what we do together. So when the first day on the first day of school, we're going to be on here um, or the first time I interact with you, we're going to be in Zoom doing synchronous learning. That means learning together. Now, if you can't make the class, something happens, you get sick or you have troubles with technology, you could do it asynchronously. You, uh, you could do it on your own. That's what that means. And then I do have a quiz. All right. So every these two things, the orientation assignment and the orientation quiz are all due by Friday, uh, the 21st on midnight, by midnight. I also have other information. If you ask questions, if you're lost, if you need to get a hold of me, you can reach me on Zoom or by email. I do have my email right over here. 
All right, but if you want to do Zoom or it's face to face live, it's after school. Here's my link. And then you'll have a password. I'll be on there every day as we wrap the school day up. You can click next. The orientation video that I'm doing right now is actually going to be in here for everybody. And then you click next again. This is how you get through your modules or you can come over here to the left, find the link for modules. There it is. Click on it. And all I'm doing that next button just gets you from one to the next, to the next, to the next. So I'm going to actually click on asynchronous. If you, if uh, you're watching this video way ahead of time, um, before we have our first class, uh, you, you can go ahead and mess with the synchronous because that's what we're going to be doing together. But for our instance, I'm going to use, for this video, I'm going to use asynchronous. Okay, so you either do one or the other. You do this with me, synchronous, or you do this on your own, asynchronous. But if you're going to, you, you need to attend class period. I prefer for you, it's better if we do this together, synchronous. I'm just showing you how the asynchronous works because for this purposes of this video, it just, it's just better. All right, so I feel great. I just click on that. You're always going to get that little, you know, how are you feeling today? So welcome to Breckenridge High School. This is Money Matters. I'm Mr. Gallegos. A little bit about me. I'm from El Paso, Texas. That's where I was born. Um, I'm a soccer player. As you can see here, we were uh, state champions my senior year. This was uh, in New Mexico, though. I'm a first generation US citizen. My parents were born in Mexico. They were born in Ciudad Juarez. And well, I was born right across the border, El Paso. And we moved to Alamogordo when I was around nine. And that's why I graduated high school from Alamogordo High School, a small town. And that small town has a has an Air Force base called Holloman Air Force Base. That's what got me into the Air Force. And there's a little picture of me when I was young. Um, that's what brought me to the San Antonio area. I was stationed at Randolph Air Force Base. Uh, and I'm still here. Uh, I did go to college when I was in the Air Force. I went to Sa San Antonio College and St. Philip's College. And my grades were really good. So I was accepted to UT Austin, their business school. And while I was at UT, I'm a Longhorn. I, uh, I went to Brazil. I studied in Brazil. I'm a soccer player in Brazil. They love soccer over there. Fun time. I uh, learned a lot. I learned how to speak Portuguese. A little bit more about me. I worked for, uh, when I graduated college, I worked, my first job out of college was working for the Austin American Statesman. It's uh, the newspaper, the biggest newspaper in Austin. I worked in human resources. Then I became an advertising consultant. Um, I also, after Austin, I, I got a job with Homevestors in real estate. I was the buyer for the We Buy Ugly Houses people, one of the franchisees. Um, then I became a banker. I worked for Chase. I was a personal banker, a business banker. Um, I currently work for St. Philip's College. The classes I've taught are right here, advertising, e-commerce, marketing, selling, and I'm still there. I've been here at Brackenridge for 10 years. I've been a deck advisor. I've run the school store, a webmaster, a yearbook. I've managed all these things. Um, so I'm, I'm very involved with Brackenridge High School. Uh, I have shifted my focus though. I've been uh, growing my businesses. My very first business was in Limbic. I still have it. I'm not as active. This is a, I create websites for businesses and they pay me money for it. Um, SA Perks is a business that I own with my wife. We sell uh, fruits, uh, juices. Actually, we sell natural juices made out of fruits and vegetables. And we also do um, eats. We have salads in a jar and all these different things, detox waters for healthy, to become healthy. And uh, I, this is my latest, my newest yet oldest venture, Mercury REI. I invest in real estate and I'm making a business out of that. I've been a landlord since I was 22 years old. So that's why I say oldest, but newest. Um, 
So this is it. I have a lot of business experience. Now it's your turn. How about you? What I'd like for you to do, if you're doing this asynchronously, you just uh, answer these questions. So right here, I've already been doing this. So what I want you to do is, what's your first name? For me, well, my first name is actually Jesus. I go by Omar, but I want you to call me Mr. Gallegos. Uh, what school do I did I attend? You guys are in middle. We're in middle school, so put your middle school. Favorite color? I had the word uh, black. It's my favorite color, like my high school colors, uh, or burnt orange. That's the other one. Uh, what do you want to do after high school? Answer that. What kind of work do you want to do when you're on your own, like after high school or or college? You know, graduate college. So respond, and then. But now, if you're doing this with me synchronously, um, you'll be doing this, we'll be doing this together. So this is if this asynchronous is on your own, if you missed the first day of school or whatever it was. All right. And I'll explain more as we go. This first week might be a little confusing, but that's why I'm doing this. Now, some information about this class. We're going to be learning about money, personal finance. This is how people manage their money. All right, so we're gonna, a lot of personal finance, I want you to become financially literate because when you're financially literate, you'll be able to make educated financial decisions. And the whole idea is for you to create a blueprint, like a map for your future financial success. Okay, a little bit more about what we're gonna be doing. We're gonna be using Zoom. I'm recording this video with Zoom, we're gonna be interacting with Zoom, but we're also gonna be act, interacting through Canvas with the modules. And these slides here are actually called pair. pair. It's a pair deck. And we're gonna be using that. We're gonna have some exit tickets. We're gonna be using, doing quizzes and exams. So more on synchronous versus asynchronous. I've been throwing that, those words around. Synchronous, all, it, all that means is that we're synchronized. We're doing things together, doing our, our scheduled class periods. If you miss that, you know, technology, your computer breaks down, your internet, something, I don't know, if you get sick, um, then you're gonna do asynchronous, meaning that you're just gonna do it on your own. So I'll have both options. Ideally, we should all be doing it synchronously together. That's the idea, because it's, it's easier for you to ask me questions while we're together in Zoom than on your own, you know, and then you have to catch me after school. So that's the plan. Uh, course schedule. Okay. I do have a course schedule. If you were to go back to modules, you'll see the course schedule right there. But I'm still building this. Don't uh, hold me to all of this. We're especially especially when we get back to school, regular school, this might all change, we'll see. But at least it'll give you an idea as to what we're gonna be doing. Uh, and sometimes, hey, we'll get through these faster than others. So this, this might change, subject to change. So don't hold me to it. Okay, are you feeling overwhelmed? You probably are, but don't worry about it. We're all in this together. We will go get through the school year together. I am here for you face-to-face uh, -face via Zoom, uh, or you can email me, jgallegos1 at saisd.net. So welcome. Welcome to Brackenridge High School, and uh, let's, let's get it going, 2020-2021. Thank you for, uh, for watching, and I'm signing off.